What is going on, YouTube people? Video Cards of Comics here today. Little Marvel card unboxing. We got Marvel Comics Universe Finding Unicorn. These are from overseas. I've opened some of the uh, Avengers 60th boxes before on the channel. We got two to open up today. Uh, I am still quite under the weather, so the voice is... We'll see how long it holds out for. This might be a little bit quieter box opening than normal. But we got 12 packs, 7 cards per pack. You can pull numbered cards out of these. And you can pull sketches out of these. Uh, the sketch, I believe the artists on the sketch card are pretty, pretty good. It's a little tricky finding information on these. Uh, because most of the stuff is in a different language. Take all the packs out. I like the way that they box these up. Interesting little box design there on that one. All right, we got packs all over the place. I'm already excited because I see Ghost Spider on the packaging artwork, so that means we got a shot to potentially pull some Gwen action. Let's see what's the best way to open. All right, let's get a feel for these. Ooh. It's really my first time kind of checking these out. Give you guys a little zoom zoom here. So some nice holographic on just the base cards. Yeah, I really like the design on just the base cards alone. Looks like something that makes a full puzzle. So that's a part of an entire image. Shield Helicarrier. Graffiti Vehicles card. Okay. And then it looks like we have a purple variant that is unnumbered. Packs are a little tricky to open. Luke Cage action. I do really like them, just the way the base cards look. Puzzle card. It's like a little bit of a throwback. And a Loki. Blue. Not numbered. So it looks like, well, at least off the rip, one variant per pack in that last slot. One puzzle card. And then a insert slot of some type ah there's the gwen it's a nice image on that i actually have uh this is the four colors variant put that off to the side War machine action warrior yeah so looks like a handful of base cards in the front and then we have our puzzle card and then the insert slot. So we have that graf vehicle graffiti, and then this just looks like a some sort of throwback. Because I had the Enchantress earlier that was like that. And then our variant slot. So this is a purple. We pulled two purples and a blue. Yeah, big fan of that Gwen or Ghost Spider artwork. I always really like that image. That cool looking Galactus. Falcon action. Puzzle piece. The thing. 
we got here? Mysterious GM card. Yeah, so that's definitely the insert slot. Yeah, purple Doctor Strange. So I believe this is all comic book art. Which I actually prefer. So we got something thick in here. I don't know, maybe we hit a sketch. Ironheart. Arrow. Yeah, I think we hit a sketch. Century sketch. Ryan Pesabi. Not familiar with that artist. Cool century sketch, though. <laughs> the Spider Mobile. Wow. And a purple Ghost Rider. So I don't know how hard the sketches are to hit. I'm going to assume pretty tricky. Nice arrow artwork. Red Skull. Oh, nice. Blackbird. And Gwenpool. Wasp, Thunder Strike, a nice surfer. I see a Fausto needs that one. Namor, puzzle card. What is this? Ooh, that's cool. That's really cool looking. I assume this is a number. No. Oh yeah. Out of a hundred. Really like the effect on that, I guess, if you will. And then a Cyclops purple. Namor, Luna, Magic, Nice Hulk. Puzzle piece. She Hulk Spotlight. Design on that too. Ooh, Gambit action. Wolverine. Black Bolt. Hercules, the Spider Punk card. Puzzle. The Guardian Ship. Kind of interesting getting vehicle cards. Thor Blue. Falcon. Shiri. Colossus. A puzzle that hits slot. There's a little Luke Cage action. And a beast. It's like Dark Beast almost. Nebula, Hercules, Mocking, Gambit, there's a puzzle. And the Quinjet. And then a cap blue parallel. I like the artwork on that cap too. Rock.
Rockets, Surfer against. We're getting some duplicates of the base cards. Nice silk. This Marvel. This puzzle piece. Purple Clea. And Ant Man. All right, that's box one. So, one numbered card. We got the Ant Man. Our one other hit was the sketch card. I don't know if those are one per box. I doubt it. But we will see. This pack feels weird. Oh, that's a crazy looking Iron Fist. It was a nice carnage. Human Torch. Spider Mobile. I think it's just these puzzle cards are a little bit of a thicker stock. And so are the vehicle cards. And yeah, a little Moon Knight action. Cage throwback and a blue invisible woman. I have I looked very quickly online. I do not know what these boxes go for. The only way that I could find to buy them was on eBay, and I really didn't see any listed yet. Spotlight Echo and a blue Gamora. But I definitely dig this design. All right, we got something in here. It's like a plexi card or something. Speak. Black Knight, Quasar, what is this? Team Up, Cap and Falcon on a very thick card. It's like a big chunky piece of plastic. Throwback Iron Man and a Iron Fist. Hang action, Valkyrie, another spotlight, this one's Spider-Woman, Hawkeye color match. Cool Magneto. I believe that's the image from the red PMG from Clear Retro. Gamora. Invisible Woman. Black Panther. And then here's our numbered card. Ooh, a silk. So that's a pretty good one. 40. Come on. There it is. 47 out of 100. Packwise here. Mm -hmm. Spectrum Thunderstrike Wasp Puzzle Card 
X Jet again, and a Purple Carnage. Gambits. Definitely getting a lot of dupes. Not a lot, but definitely getting some dupes of base cards. So it's probably not a super huge checklist. Great artwork on that Jean Grey. Venom action. Modoc. Sentry. Collector. Root. See, some of this stuff I feel like I'm seeing for the first time. And then we're still getting some dupes. So I don't know if it's just coll collation or what. Page and Black Panther. We got two left. Doom. Doc Ock. Wow. That's crazy Doc Ock artwork. No Doc. Yeah, I feel like that pack, I haven't seen any of those ones yet. Captain Marvel and a Blade. And last pack. Rogue. Electra. White Tiger. Ah, there's Spider-Man. Puzzle piece. We got a black cat and a watcher. So, looks like one numbered hit per box and then one other hit per box. So our two numbered were the Ant-Man and Silk. And I'm guessing there's probably other variations other than these golds. Really like the way that Silk gold looks. And then our hit in box two was this Acetate team-up card. And then in box one, we hit the Sketch. So, pretty fun. Really like the way the base cards look. Like I said, I I would I, I don't have a good idea on, like, value, is it worth it, or whatever, because I don't know what these box prices are going to be going for. Um, I do like the base card design. Collation feels a little weird on some of them, because um, we definitely got a lot of dupes in some, but in others, I was opening packs late in the box, too, and seeing some of the cards for the first time. So, I uh, just kind of keep that stuff in mind. Fun product for sure. At least it feels fun. Like I said, it's fun with an asterisk, uh, depending on what box prices go for on these. So, all I got for you, boys and girls. We will catch you on the next one. Peace.